Hey, what's happening, folks? Thanks, but now one here, and I'm back with my third Elite Team Cabin Collection completion video, and this is pretty dope. I pulled another Elite Badge, my sixth one, which makes more Elite Badges pulled in this game than Elite Cards out of Pro Packs. Do with that what you want to. Let's go ahead and complete this set, and pretty much I'm doing this right now only because I ended up pulling an Elite Badge once again. Like I said earlier, like I, I forgot I said that, but anyway, pulled an Elite Badge, and because I pulled the Elite Badge, Instead of doing a set like the Panthers or the Texans or the Colts, I decided I'm going to do the Steelers one right now because this collection is an awful one to do because you're not going to make much profit on this collection. The Elite Badge is 50k, Antonio Brown's like 90, or not 90k, but 40,000 coins, so combine those two is 90,000 coins right there. And the Heath Miller only goes for 80k. So if you got the two Elite cards going in a set, plus all the golds and silvers, you'll be losing coins, but because I pulled it, I think I might have spent, what, like 80K? So I've kind of broke even. I pulled the Antonio Brown, and I'm going to go ahead and count them as well. So if I pull an Elite Badge, I'm going to put the Elite Badge in the sets that are really not worth doing. And if I want to do a set like the Titans, which one I can do make profit on. If I want to do like the Panthers, which I can make profit on, those will be the sets I buy the Elite Badge for. So it's kind of like my weird method about doing these sets and hopefully we get these things done and become a mutt master but my luck so far with legacy collectibles aren't there again my luck's off on this game i've opened up at least 10 of those packs and only got in nothing i got a bunch of 500 quick sales and some bronze and gold badges plus this elite badge so that has been my highlight pool we got that 15k corner look at that new little animation they got it's pretty cool right there liking what i'm seeing and we got the heath miller team captain card Mutt Master Steelers Collect. Let's go ahead and collect this bad boy real quick. I can't. Okay. Oh, anyway. Okay. What the bleep? <laughs> Here is a team captain Heath Miller. If you guys have not seen this card yet, 81 speed, 93 catching and catching in traffic, great awareness, pretty decent strength, route running, and run blocking. Like this guy's card. Not going to use it. Uh, slow tight ends on my team aren't really needed unless you guys got great run blocking. And because I'm doing a theme team right now, Pittsburgh Steelers, nowhere near the south. So I can't use this guy on my team. I'm going to compare this guy right now to my best tight end being Kyle Rudolph. Like, I need to get Greg Olson really quick. And Rudolph has the same kind of height and speed, but the catching is not there. And for a tight end that made a living going across the middle of the field, absorbing big hits from linebackers like Ray Lewis, yeah, this guy has got great catching, a good card to have for those who want reliable targets. And Heath Miller, not a bad option. 80,000 coins for a dependable, sturdy tight end. I mean, Jason Wooden might be better, but I mean, Heath Miller, a little bit faster. Let's go ahead and collect that collectible. I am 11 out of 66, and I could potentially be, what is this to see? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I could be 19 if I were to just go ahead and do the gold coach collections. I just don't see the value in it. I can sell the coach like 25 to 20K, buying the gold badge. It's just really expensive. I do have gold badges to use. It just doesn't seem like a good investment by gold badges at this stage, especially if they drop some collections that require gold badges. I want to be prepared. I don't want to, I don't want to take that chance. So I'm not going to be doing these right now until I get all of the legacy collectibles. But anyway, let's go ahead and collect this uh, Steelers collect. Look at that. Yeah. Look at that 11. We are making progress, guys. Making progress. I will get this bad boy done. I'm not too sure when, Hopefully, it'll be in the next couple of years. Like, <laughs> anyway, folks, that's the video. I'm the Texas Boy. I'll catch y'all mother bleepers later. Peace.